Hey y'all, and welcome to the Looking Glass Tarot and to Carter Cards of the Day. I do hope this finds you well. And as always, this is a general reading for the collective. So you will see it when and if you are meant to. And it is timeless. So let's get into our reading today and let's see what Spirit has. That was pretty quick. The Eight of Swords. So this is a, a, bound, a binding card. Like you feel like you're bound to something. Like, you know, you, you can't see your way out of it. Um, but you're not really as bound as you think you are. Because you do see that the bandages around you, you can still see out there. They're not tight. You can get out of those. There's room there for you to move through the sword. So you can move forward. You're not restricted and bound like you think you are. It's your mind making you think that way. So you're in your head. So whatever the issue or the problem is that you're dealing with or the situation, it, it your mind is, is worse than it really is. It's making you think there's no way out. You've got all these things coming at you that, you know, you couldn't possibly, there couldn't possibly be an end to this. You couldn't solve this. There's no solutions or no answers. But if you get out of your head and not think all the negative thoughts, you, there is a solution because the swords are about clarity, mental clarity, about finding answers, finding solutions, um, looking up information. So the swords are there for you to use. It's just get, you're going to have to get out of your head and make that, make that first move and not let it make you feel like there's no, no situation that you can't handle because you can let's see why the eight of swords is here let's see why the eight of swords is here right there okay the knight of swords so that's that is a great card to come out of the eight of swords because this is telling you as a knight of swords you are now moving into the position of truth clarity finding out your answers you're going to go right into this and not be intimidated not be scared of of the answer because the answer is there and you're going to find it because the knight of swords is moving in moving quickly into a situation and hitting taking it head on so you're just going to face this head on and you're going to take care of this problem because you can you can work around it because the knight of swords is mental clarity also he's moving forward he's moving with facts and he's moving with um, truth and justice and facts so with the eight of swords being here with the knight of swords this is like move forward you know you've got the information you need you've got um, the sources you need you've got the proof or the uh, whatever it is that you've been compiling and trying to figure out it, it's there you've got it you just need to move forward with it and uh, as you're moving forward, keep that same determination. Don't don't second guess yourself, because at the the Knight of Swords does not second guess himself. He just heads right in and takes care of what he needs to. Let's skip one more card, because it's like you're over it. It's like I'm over it and I'm headed headed at, I'm headed to take care of business. That's what the Knight of Swords is telling me with this card, with the Eight of Swords. Ace of Wands, and you're headed right into a new beginning and a new start. That's the Ace, and Wands are quick too for me, I feel like. And the Ace of Wands is new start, new beginnings, new things you're going to be headed into, new direction. Um, yes, yeah, going to be different, it's going to be scary, you know, it's going to be unknown to you. But it, and it's going to, but I feel like it's a new adventure, it's like a new, um, of course it's new to you, but I feel like it's like, outside of your box it's almost like 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 you've never done this before and maybe people around you aren't happy about the direction you're going so they've been kind of giving you kind of play it talking to you and maybe that's why you're in, in your head a little bit but i feel like you're you're moving in the direction you want to be so you're you put that out of your head so this is going to be like outside of the box this is going to be something new for you that you've never done before. So with the Ace of Wands being here, it's like, go for it. And I kind of feel like it happened pretty quickly, like I said, with Ace. 
um, being here, but wands is the Ace of Wands is great. There we go. Action. There you go. Now is the perfect time to act. Take inspired action towards your dreams. Move forward with confidence. And that's what I was saying. Move forward. Time to go. You got everything you need. Get moving. Get going. Um, facts, truth, answers. Um, you've done your job. You've gotten the, the answers you need. And you're moving forward into what you want to do. So now is definitely with the Ace of Wands being here. And the Knight of Swords is telling you now is time to... Now is your time to take action. Don't, you know, move forward now. And do it with confidence. Like I was saying, the Knight of Swords is very confident and uh, headstrong. So that's how you need to head into this situation also. And with excitement because it's something new for you and it's something you really wanted to do. And you can't do what others want to make. You got to do what you want to make you happy. Let's see what spirit animal card we got. There we go. The humpback whale singer. Sing healing songs for the world. Your inner navigation always guides you. Nothing can stop you or keep you from your goal. Align with your purpose and the power in your soul. So there you go. That's another good one to go. Um. You know, it's, it's just telling you, let your intuition guide you. It's guided you this far. You you know, you were in your head a little bit because people were maybe nagging at you and saying, you can't do that. You know, you what would make you want to do that? Why do you want to go that direction? You know, and they kind of got you in your head second guessing yourself. So that's why the Knight of Swords is here. It's like, don't second guess yourself. Have confidence. Move forward. And now you got the Ace of Wands, which is really telling you, yes, this is your time you're doing what you need to do for you take action do it with confidence and you know let the world know who you are because this is what you wanted to do step out into what you wanted and quit kind of like hiding behind what other people wanted you to do step forward and be the person you want to be do the things you want to do um and take that action and and let let you, i'm here and let your voice be heard and that's probably why the singer is here is, you know, let your voice be heard because I kind of feel like you were, like I said before, letting them tell you what to do, putting stuff in your mind. So now that you are letting, singing as in letting yourself and your um, voice be heard, things are moving in the, in the direction it needs to. So always let your voice be heard. Always speak up for yourself and use your intuition along the way and go for it. So thank you for watching everyone. I do appreciate you. I do appreciate my subscribers and um, everyone for watching my videos. Please have a great day and love and light and bless be.